to be to acknowledge is the support of the Department of Sport, Arts and Culture. Honestly, this kind of support does not come every day. Their support has enabled us to do a lot of things that we would not have been able to do throughout the years. You know, um, the Northern Cape Writers Festival started when literary events in the country were not fashionable. Mm. I mean, when the first one took place in 2007, we had very few in the country. And right now, almost every second major city in South Africa has an annual literary festival. And it's been ongoing throughout all that time. And we think we're looking forward to another 10 years, another 20 years, another 50 years. But let us also remember that when we gather at the literary festival, we gather to celebrate the literature that we've been working hard to produce. So it is very important what happens between festivals. From a festival to another festival, writing must take place. A lot of effort must be put into that. You have to put in a lot of hours as a writer, as a poet. And that is what matters the most. The other thing we need to also know that, see we live in the Northern Cape, but the Northern Cape is part of South Africa. South Africa is part of Africa and the world. There will come a time when you qualify to be on the program, not solely on the basis of the fact that we are born in the Northern Cape. Time will come when that does not matter much, when we are simply saying, let us look at your work. What have you produced? What has earned your way into this? So we need to work hard. Uh, in January, first or second week of January, we're going to have our third summer school. We're going to call for applications where people are going to submit samples of their writings and they are selected. And with the summer school, we, we never have more than 20 people mm. for that whole week, which is a good camp, really. We never have more than 20, so it is very competitive getting in there. And in the future, it is very competitive getting on the program of the Northern Cape Writers Festival. But before then, all of us need to put in hours to make sure that there is quality literature coming out of here. Exactly. You know, we're not only interested in, in you writing books, but interested in you writing books that have interesting lives. The highlight of a book should not be the launch. And then after the launch, you don't know what, what happens to the book. The book is stressing you because nobody is interested in it. It, 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 it has a boring life. We're interested in you writing a book that takes its place alongside books from anywhere. <coughs> not, not just a book that is going to be purchased by the government, friends and family. You have to write a book where somebody says, I've got the last 200 rand for the weekend, what am I going to do? I'm going to buy a book and six pack and my weekend is sorted. We need to get there. You need to get to a point where somebody says, oh, my brother, I've been looking for you. I saw your book somewhere. Mm. Because it is so good that it spoke for you. That's, that's the quality we need. That's the quality we need to strive. And that is what has to happen between festivals. Because festivals, like I said, is where we celebrate what we have been working hard to do, to achieve. So thank you so much. It's, it's also extraordinary that people gather for days, travel for hundreds of kilometers 
for literature. Hmm. Now we used to travel a long distances for music festivals. But I think it says a lot about our development as people mm. that we're able to stick around hundreds of kilometers from home for literature. It does not happen every day. It never used to happen in the past. And it's not happening. We are doing that. So I think we, we're really getting somewhere. Well, thank you once again. We apologize for all the hiccups that were there. We, we really apologize for all those hiccups, and we are really grateful that you are here and you've been with us until the end of the program. So you'll receive our emails, and please respond. Remo Disa said, don't hold back when you're giving us your opinion. So please um, do respond. Thank you so much.